Parade Home number seven, Red Rock Colonial Haven. This home is for sale for 5.5 and can still be yours. This home is 8,295 total square feet. Comes with seven bedrooms, eight bathrooms, three floors, and a six car garage. You guys will not believe what's inside this home. Let's go check it out. There's an office to the front and then a piano room right off the entryway. They've got glass sliding doors that can shut all the way. Look at the ceiling. That's pretty cool. Center Island is massive. Double oven back here, another little cooktop. Induction tub, so you can yeah. grab stuff back here or keep stuff warm. Microwave, a farmhouse seat. Two, or two dishwashers, I don't know why I called it a microwave. Wolf appliances. I love the hardware too. I've never seen this. Uh huh. <clears throat> Let's go check out outside why we're why we're here. This is the ultimate privacy. You probably have some pretty amazing views from the top of those stairs. Well, we've got three floors to cover, so we've got we've got a ways to go. Oh, I love this over here. Let's see. I love gardens. Cool garden area. That's awesome. I love it. This is a proper home gym with rogue equipment. Uh huh. One set of sliders takes you out back, and then we have a slider right here that. And look, look at the views. Look at the views from this direction. So what's really cool about this is you can open all three of these sliders. Hey, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> um, the front slider, you have a party or something, you have people come in through that, right? Yep. And look at, check out your views from here. Sweet. Yeah, there's a lot of sliding doors. This gym has its own ensuite bathroom. This is kind of cool that this is just open. So this is also going to be the pool bathroom as well. The door is right behind you. Yeah, they hit, I saw that. We saw that in the last house. It's kind of like that bamboo tile. Yeah, it's a recessed shower, so there's no barrier. And the lights backlit, or the mirror. The mirror is backlit. Mm -hmm. That's cool. So yeah, what I was saying earlier, you have access to the pool. 
Steamer things? Yeah, it was a steamer. Oh no, is it? That's cool. This is my family's business. They did all the lighting in this house. Running for three generations strong. Pretty cool. They they provide the lighting in most of the parade homes. Yeah. Yeah, my great grandpa started it. Um, what are these? Just some cool cabinetry. Got a little mini fridge. Look at this cute little tiny sink. Perfect just for washing your hands. It's a little like a prep sink. Uh huh. Actually, what this is is uh, it's a hers and his. Yeah, there's a hers. So there's and a hers. hers. Yeah. And, and that's what you is. get. Good luck with that sink. Yeah, that's all you need. That's all he needs. This is perfect. Or not necessarily his and hers. However, it's distributed. Hers and hers, his and his. His and hers, hers and his. Hers and hers, hers and his. Check out this wet room. Wow. That is huge. It is massive. Like, family showers, everybody. This is, I would say, it's the size of a. Size Chicago or LA studio. Pretty cool. Look at that light. Costco special. I wanted that tree, remember? <laughs> it's a good looking tree. has a slider in it. You know, it's really cool because the slider essentially provides a floor to sit in. Okay. Yeah. Lots of natural light. I mean, lots of natural light is not one of the most overused or over expressions. Ooh, this feels nice. already passed me and I was like, oh, I haven't seen her since high school. Yeah. Oh, this window. And how cool this has got room for like a little sitting area. Yeah, like if you want to like just take a break and take in some views. If you're out of breath on the first slide of stairs, just take a breather and then continue.
Hello friends, I hope that you're enjoying this video as much as we enjoyed making it. There's truly only one thing that we enjoy more than making these videos, and that's hearing from you. So if you're watching this video and you're thinking that St. George might be a great place for you, or maybe you're thinking about relocating somewhere else in Southern Utah, or the entire state of Utah for that matter, please reach out to us. We would absolutely love to be of service to you. Our contact information is in the description below this video, as well as a link to reserve a time in our calendar for an obligation-free meeting so we can chat and see if we could be a good fit for each other and if Southern Utah is right for you. Without further ado, let's get back to this video. This is where the cool people hang out. Oh, it's got a little mini fridge and sink behind you. Go check out this balcony. Oh, now we get a better view of what was above those stairs. Oh, wow. Yeah, so that literally takes you to that, that uh, walking path. Back there. So that must be where the lot line ends for that string. That and I'm assuming that pad is probably extra room for a sport gorge or helicopter landing, whatever you want. Like, there's somebody hiking up against that rock right yeah. there. Yeah, somebody's kids Somebody's stepping out of line. Oh, there's like a cave in there too. That's kind of cool. Okay. Yeah, literally every room has a slider. Hey, why did that window looks like it opens? Because it does. I think you could open it from that deck. Okay, because it totally looks like it. Or you just want to let lots of fresh air in? Okay, yeah, because yeah, it had that same seal, so that's cool that it opens. Mm-hmm. Look at the tile you're stepping on. I haven't seen that before. Cute little wallpaper accent by the mirror. I'm not gonna lie, I'm getting lost. I know, I'm so sorry. So that looks like a little loft area. I, they probably just haven't added a ladder. Probably for the sake of the parade. Yeah. yeah the loft right. area is pretty cool. And then access to the front deck. Sorry, I'll stop doing that. I know. Oh, look over there. Just kidding. I wonder how, oh, okay, yeah. Like all of these windows open. They've got a little handle right here. That's cool. This has a little loft above there too. Fun for the kids. And look on the ceiling, you can see the lights that turn on those little can lights up there. That's cool. Hello bed, I love you. That's exactly how I feel at the end of every night. Of every day. This closet's bigger than I expected. No, I'm not 
This I was just thinking the same thing. Yeah. There's like an oven and everything. That's pretty cool. You see the staircase that takes you up here? Yeah. So you can walk this all way and have your own access from downstairs to this piece of that. You're perfect mother. I know. That's why you build a small house when you are getting close to retirement. And that just goes right outside? Yeah, and look, your mother in law loves to cook. So we got some really nice appliances in this combat. Nice induction cooktop. So she has the starting fires. Really good sized thing. Like this kitchen looks miniature, but uses still, you know, the bottom of 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 the bottom that's the garage. <laughs> Let's get a shot of this garage real quick. It's a really good sized garage. So it's kind of hard to see from the interior shot of this garage. You actually pull in on the front of the property, come all the way around, and you have this really nice area to park your vehicles where they're out of sight from the front of the property and, you know, enter your garage that way too. I don't know, some people might love it, some people might hate it. I think it's kind of nice that from the front, from the front, most like, of this house doesn't look like a garage. I mean, most of it just looks like you've got an RV garage. Yeah, at the front, I was like, where is the rest of the garage? Thank you for sticking around that far into this video. If you're seriously considering moving into this area, maybe you're thinking about building a custom home, we would absolutely love to be a resource to you. We have a great relationship with so many custom home builders in Southern Utah. We have a long list of general contractors that we would recommend. We have an even longer list of general contractors that we would recommend you avoid. If we could be of service to you, please feel free to reach out to us. Our contact information is in the description below this video. And there's a link for Calendarly so you could hop on our schedule for a quick call if that's the route you'd like to go. And as always, please give this video a thumbs up so the algorithm can suggest it to more people. And if you haven't already subscribed, please make sure to smash the subscribe button so you don't miss any of our future videos.